there. This is Lana's Enchanted Sky, your spiritual fairy godmother, bringing you your water sign readings from the 10th to the 17th of April, 2023. Please hit like and subscribe for a chance to win a free reading, hypnosis, whatever I do, all that good stuff. Also, Lana's Enchanted Sky um, got a new website coming, so keep its eyes and plus predictions. All of that's going to be coming out on there. Uh, it's all, it's a lot of work, guys. So I'm trying to get it done. Now, joke of the day, I always tell me, tell a joke, and if I laughed at them, I will tell it, and it did. Okay, so anyway, as I was saying, anyway, so I just found out that this company produces, uh, uh, that produces yardsticks won't be making them any longer. There's your joke. All right, so hold on here. Let's see what we got. Now, you do know that you're usually more than one sign, right? You do understand that, right? That you're, I'm three of the four signs. That's why my... That's why the cards work. Because when I'm shuffling, I'm basically, I'm putting intent towards you. But yet the intent comes back to me. So that's why people are like, how do these work? That's why. Now, there is a couple of the same cards as the fire sign. So I just, I'm going to explain this to you. So earlier in the week, you're going to be taking the bull by the horns. Now, this could be you going to the doctor too. But I want to say this is you. You have all the, the things you need to be successful and you need to go with it now here comes an offer of money there's some type of offer being presented to you it's very emotional now there could even be another person involved that would be a youthful person they're gay they're creative they're okay and they but i more than anything it's an emotional message this these are both message messages this is ends up being an offer or something that's very emotional very, and it comes early in the month. Now, they're telling you and warning you that that message should be well thought out, well planned, well executed. Don't go crazy. Stay grounded. Stay logical. That's what this means. So be whatever that, that offer is, they're kind of telling you, please be careful. Now, in the middle of the month, there's something that's being, and it could be that message even, but something's coming to you in 30 days. And... It is a new start, and it has to do with a King of Pentacles. Now, a King of Pentacles can be, you know, um, it can be a person. It can be male. It can even be female. But um, because it's a it's a real strong card, right? So it could be Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, and it's an offer, and it's going to go quickly. Now, it may have something to do with a car, also. So all they know has something to do with transportation or movement quick forward, okay, going forward. So in the middle of the week, that something like that's going to happen for you. So make your choices. Be careful. I know um, that it's telling you to just be very careful with your choices you're making. Don't go overboard. So you might be offered something that you might think of like, oh, my God, I got, I got a quick answer. No. Now. This card is saying to take your time. This card says you're going to be moving quickly. So on it. So they're warning you, balance, balance, balance. Okay. Now, later in the week, you're, somebody's going to help you with something. You're getting help from somebody. Here comes an offer. Here comes a potential offer. And it has to do with, with a meeting of somebody. Meeting of minds. This could be a doctor. Um, and there's a, but there's a choice. Okay, because these cards, now this could be love for a lot of people. Because there's an offer coming and that help is being, but this is love. Now, it doesn't necessarily hear some people mean love. It can mean that you have a choice to make either way. But it ha you have a choice to get involved in a relationship with somebody. And it doesn't necessarily have to be love. So I'm letting you know, for certain people it might not be. But for certain people, this is big. I just know that when these are together, that is love. Now, I know that I, for me personally, um, been married a long time, whatever. And I, when I would pull these cards, it could be a business partner. And it has been. Um, so I want you to be aware that you have to, a choice to make. Are you going to bite? Are you going to bite the apple, you know, Adam and Eve? Are you going to go ahead with it? Be careful. Make your choices. They're telling you. They keep saying that card, temperance. Temperance means to never over. Yeah, never overreact. 
stay grounded, stay logical. Tem the temperance movement in the early 1900s was abstinence from alcohol. So they didn't want anybody, they said temperance will keep you from doing something. I just had an orb go by. <laughs> if you guys are watching me, you always see them. It just went this way. Just, did you see it? Yeah. So um, just be careful and in your decisions and just don't overdo anything. It feels like it's revving up. And like I said, there could be movement. Okay. So, all right. So here we go. The energy is gaining momentum. That's what I'm trying to say. Stay logical. Stay, because it seems like you're going to start, you've got a lot of things to do or there's something like that. Okay. Look at the bigger picture. Back up. Get a new perspective. Make your mind up. You have to step out of your comfort zone on this. You might be too comfortable in what you're doing, and you, you might have to make some decisions with that new start stuff. Now, they want to also remind you that your hard work is paying off. It's not like you're not making any progress. Okay. And a fiery climax is approaching. So something's going to happen. Something's got to give. That's what they're trying to tell you. And believe in the impossible. I, I noticed I got my flying pig up here. That's one of my, my totem animals is a flying pig because you ever have a fantasy creature. Um, and I have flying pigs. I have them all over because it believe in the impossible, okay? Because it, something is going to happen. Did you see that again? There was an orb up there. And I and I, went, I invite you guys to look them up. It's not bugs. It's not bugs. It, they're orbs. Um, you can If you blow them up and slow them down and you get a picture, let me see. I would love to. They look to look like little things, like and they're like little. They look like AOL guys, but they they like they praying. They're praying. I, I I swear to you. So they're blessing me, and that's they will appear in my videos all the time. So <laughs> blessings to you. Make it a great day, and how can you make the earth a better place? Blessings.